Hello everyone. My name is Harshit Bhutra and you're watching Digital Sun City. On this channel, I make videos related to WordPress and digital marketing. So, if you want to learn more of WordPress and digital marketing, then you can press the subscribe button below. That way, you'll be notified as soon as I publish a new video. So now, let's get started with this video. Do you want to add custom WordPress notices for your visitors in your WordPress website? In this video tutorial, you will learn how to add warning notices for your website visitors. So to do that, go to your WordPress admin dashboard, hover on to plugins and then click on add new. In the search bar, search for WP notification bars. Now you have to install this plugin by my theme shop. Now click on install now and then later activate the plugin. So once you have activated this plugin, scroll down and you will see that the plugin is now activated. Now hover on to notification bars present at the left hand side of the screen. Now click on add new. Here you can add new custom notification bar. Now you can rename this title to anything you want. In my case, I am typing hello. Now coming first to the general settings, you can select any of the buttons options like toggle button, close button or no button from hide close button option. I am selecting the close button option here. You can change the content width as well. So content width is set to greater than 960px. Now you can select notification bar CSS positioning from here. It can be fixed or absolute. I am selecting absolute. Fix this basically it will stick to the top which is not what we need. Now click on content from the top bar. You can set the content here in two ways either by using the custom button or by text link button. In the text and link button settings you can select link style as link or button. I am writing hello world as an example here in the text box so that you can see it. Now you can write anything or any kind of warning or notice which you want to display to your customers. Now let's click on style from the top bar and you can select the colors of background or text colors according to your need. You can also set the font size as per your own requirement. Now go to conditions from the top bar. Here you can select when and where to display this notification bar. For example, I click on on specific locations. You can click on any location you want. You can set any conditions from here like from Google or not from Google for Facebook or not from Facebook. If you select not from Facebook then the notification bar won't be seen to the visitors coming from Facebook. If you select from Google the notification bar will be displayed to visitors arriving from Google. Once everything is sorted click on the publish button present in the right hand side of the screen. Once it's updated let's move to our website and you can see a warning notice which we have set. So that's how easy it is to add warning notices for your visitors in WordPress website. I hope you like this video. It takes me a lot of efforts to create free videos like these for all of you people. So please consider to subscribe. And if you have any questions or suggestions, then you can directly go to our website digitalsuncity.com slash help and then fill in the contact form with your question. I'll reply to that as soon as possible. Thank you for watching this video. Hey, before you quit, I have an amazing offer for you. I am giving away free access to all of my digital resources to all of my viewers. These digital resources can be divided in two types. The first thing is layouts. This includes hundreds of templates for Divi, Elementor, Visual Composer and a lot of royalty free graphics which you can use on any website. Now the second thing is premium WordPress video tutorials. In the coming weeks, I am creating video courses for all the major WordPress themes and plugins. This will include video tutorials for WordPress, Divi, Astra, Elementor, Visual Composer and lot more. So as you can see, I have already started working on them. Now to get all of these premium digital resources, you have to go to my website digitalsuncity.com slash VIP and put in your email address. And then you will receive an email which will contain all of these things. That's it. So go to the link in the description right now and claim all of these resources instantly. I am waiting for you to get my digital resources for free.